Good morning, y'all. Uh. Good morning, Shaw. some more digging with Penny yesterday. It's looking good over here. Hey, we got a frog living down in there already. That's pretty cool. What if you look how much more I've dug out. And now that that area is drying out over here, I can go down and I can sit on that with Penny and dig out some more of this area, which I'm gonna dig around this rock, and dig around that area right there. And then I'll scoop this area out and dump it. And then I start working my way back, trying to sweep my way out of the pond. It's going good, but that's going to take a lot. But I'm going to use the front bucket for that area. This is what I had to use the backhoe to dig around. And I'm going to bust up that rock a little bit more. But, hey, we making progress. We got a decent sized hole now, y'all. Yeah. We making progress. Let's see what it look like from over here. Yeah, that's going to be a decent size little pond right there it's gonna be decent yep and it's gonna be pretty deep I'm assuming that right now that's about five to probably five to six feet deep on uh, maybe not maybe not six feet that might be about five feet five and a half but we're gonna get this down that low too and we're gonna find somewhere to put all this dirt <laughs> all right let's get out on this walk It's amazing to me how fast these trails dry up out here. They dry up so quick, but my trails be muddy for so long. Maybe it's because of how long they've been walked on. Hey, good morning, y'all. We out here in the water. Hey, y'all. So, let me explain something to y'all. I've been reminded why I hate diesel and gas products so much. Hey, so yesterday I went to go get some gas cans filled uh, with diesel and then one with gas and then I got some gas for the van, right? Well, while I was trying to get the diesel out the van, when I pulled back on the handle, it kind of like opened and closed real quick. Hey, it didn't feel like a gallon of diesel came out that thing and just that quick of a, oh, little guy, you didn't make it. Yep, yeah, it's okay. So, Anyway, it splashed all over me, and it was a lot. Hey, and that bothered the heck out of me. So, I mean, if you know what it's like getting diesel fuel on your clothes, you can't never get that smell out. Like, never. And so, that's why I so wanted to stay away from diesel and gas. And I forgot why, but boy, I tell you, Penny has become back as a reminder. And I'm gonna be honest, this is kind of like a love-hate relationship because that smell gives me, oh, I don't know what it is, but I've smelled that smell around some of the worst times of my life. <laughs> so I don't like that smell at all, but I can't get away from it. I'm saying oil, diesel, gas, I can't get away from it. And I tell you, until Tesla make a, a penny, a tractor made by Tesla, oh boy, it's gonna be a long time, and boy, that's gonna be a lot of money. Hey, but I ain't giving up on Penny, cause Penny putting in work, yeah. Yep, she putting in work. And I tell you, yesterday I said I, I dug out a good bit of that pond. I'm gonna be honest, when I'm sitting around and I got absolutely nothing to do. It's nothing better than playing with that backhoe. Only thing I hate about playing with that backhoe is, boy, if it's even a little bit muddy outside, even a little bit muddy, you uh, 
Man, spiderwebs, y'all, my bad. Yeah, this is gonna mess up the conversation because, boy, spiderwebs do me in. Yeah, but when you playing around with the man, die, gone. Two people killed a coke right here or one coke drinker just sat in this one area. Man, I tell you, people have no respect for stuff that ain't theirs. Heck, a lot of people don't respect what is theirs. How, how can you expect them to respect what ain't? I get it. Man. Anyway. Yeah, I was saying, you get that backhoe filled up with mud, dirt, that boy gets compacted. And the second thing, I'm going to be honest, you can't get much dirt far away from that, that backhoe. Like, I'm digging in a hole that's round. <laughs> you got to park at an angle and dig from one side and dump to the other. But then you can't put down your brace on one side if you get it too much of the angle. So you got to find the right angle, and I still ain't found that yet. But I'm getting better at it. And this is one of the things that I like about this is I'm learning as I go. I don't have much time to sit around and watch YouTube videos, though. I mean, I do a lot of stuff with the kids during the day. Hey, we went up the right path yesterday. Went ahead and looked in the, the uh, uh, what is it called? I don't use the place, the class six. We went in there yesterday. I went and looked for my client to see if he had any, uh, if the prices would be cheaper. He said it looked a little bit cheaper, but it might not be worth going up there. I don't know. If he hit me up, I'll take him up there, though. Because I'm saying, he's been with me a long time. <laughs> and every week. It ain't just, he been in, he been with me for five years. Nope. I'm saying, he been on an every week appointment for that long. <laughs> yep. That's what I'm saying. I got people to take care of me. So I do my best to try and return it. I know, it's like, man, that was cheap of you. No, what I'm saying is, he know me. If he ever want to go up there, I'll go up that way and he say he want me to pick him up something. <laughs> nah, I don't really even be drinking like that. I don't drink. Well, I do, but I drink wine most of the time. Anything other, I don't know. I don't know why either. It's not like I don't. I just hate the way it be making me feel the next day. Oh my goodness. I already be having a hard time getting up with the right mindset, a positive mindset. Boy, when I have a drink, it be like, oh, let me keep my eyes closed for a few more minutes. <laughs> I don't like that feeling. I need to get up and at it with my day. Yep. But now, I ain't saying I don't drink, cause boy, I will drink some wine. Oh yeah. And that junk don't bother me at all. Especially red. Only thing I drink is Merlot though. Merlot, and I ain't had that in a while. I don't know. I feel like my body ain't been wanting it. And that's cool. I just listen to what my body tell me. I don't be feeling like I need that to unwind now. Now I get I get enough activity in. I don't know. I don't know. And I ain't got nothing to say about that. I'm enjoying myself these days. Hey, wine being out my system ain't so bad. I started that on the I started that on the deployment. I don't know if it was a bad habit or a good habit, but boy it helped me get through some hard times it felt like. Boy, I was on one deployment. Three drinks a night. Yep, we was at the wheel. That's why I started doing poetry night side. Yep, got my three drinks. Went out there and let them have it. Man, you had to go. I don't know if anybody ever been over in a place like that. Qatar, you go over there. You get that three drinks. You get like three beers, but you can only have one at a time. <laughs> Hey, forget about a beer. I'd rather just drink some wine. Yep, drink one, two, three. One right behind the other. <laughs> Never did I have more. Never did I ask for another. Never did I ask for my drink for my brother. 
And yeah, I always try to remind myself to call my mother. Every chance I got. Now, <laughs> hey, that was just a horrible. I, what the heck am I doing? I'm out here having too much fun today. See, trying to rhyme, thinking of stuff, wasn't even working. Forgot I'm supposed to get down this hill like I was twerking. <laughs> oh. Hey, I'll be having too much fun out here. In the mornings. Hey, did y'all count the hang time on that? Yeah, your boy just did a takeoff. Uh-huh. I be having too much fun. Hey. I don't know where to go. Today is Monday. I got to cut the grass. You're supposed to go to the pool. I done missed a couple swims in a row. Hey, yeah. I got a public service announcement. Yeah, so I heard on my way out the door this morning that they didn't say they did, are researching 800 cases, 800 cases of heart problems related to the vaccine. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that because I had just said not too long ago that I felt like I had a whole lot of people around me that were dying or in the hospital because of heart attack. I said that right around the time I was saying RIP to DMX because he had a heart attack. I mean, they think it was drug related, I don't know. But what I'm saying is, it was just funny because around that time, I was losing a lot of people in my life to heart attack. I mean, one of my partners, a friend, my number one subscriber, she gone. I'm saying, I didn't lose nobody to COVID. Not that I know of. I ain't saying I lost nobody to a vaccine shot either, but I'm saying I just started losing a whole lot of people to heart problems. Hey, let's try and keep our hearts as healthy as possible, y'all. I need everybody to get up, get out, get active. Do something in your life. Can't have no more, no more losses. We ain't taking no more losses, y'all. I need y'all to get up and do something good for yourself today. Because I need y'all to be here with me tomorrow. Look at the size of that snake. Damn, I thought that was a log. Oh my goodness. What do I do, y'all? Let him be? Or y'all want to see him move? That boy huge. Goodness. Hey, and I don't see his head nowhere. Um, let's go. Oh, that's his head! <laughs> yeah. I ain't see his head nowhere till then. Hey, what y'all wanna do? Wanna be ballers? Shot callers? Let's let him be. You free? <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, he was a bigger one. I ain't see his head. I walked past him. I'm like, man, that looked like a funny branch. It looked just like a branch going across the... Whoo! Hey, I don't know how I sounded on that one, but boy, we just saw him. <laughs> hey, no, I ain't picking up no snake, y'all. What the heck wrong with y'all asking me to pick it? Why did you pick him up and take him? No. No. Especially not. I didn't know what that was. I didn't know what he was. I thought that he was headed the other direction because his body got wide in a very different area, but he probably just got done eating something. Hey, all I can say is, I said, <laughs> I don't see his head. Let's get his body going. Oh my goodness, that was his head. <laughs> hey, that's what I mean. You never know what we gonna see out here in the morning. Hey, I never know what I'm going to see out here in the morning. And that's exactly what I mean. I've been seeing a lot of spider webs. And I've been seeing, oh my goodness, a snake almost every other day now. Yeah, y'all ain't been able to see. Wait, hold on. Let me zip up before that snake falls out. <laughs> hey, my bad, y'all. Good morning, Monday. 
How y'all day going? Good. Hey, that snake. You see what I'm saying, though? You got to pay attention out here. That boy was not moving. I was like, I've never seen that branch here before. Not once. <laughs> hey, I walked back on the like, hey, that didn't look like no. I knew it was something different. Uh-huh. I said, wait. Wait, 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 wait a minute. See, it was like one of these things. That's what it looked like to me at first. But I was like, I ain't never seen that there before. And he was chilling. I wonder if he's still going to be there when I get back. He might have just got done eating and can't really move. If he can't move, he's going to be stuck there. And he probably put his head underneath that log so that something would think he was a vine like I was, like I did. And so nothing will peck at his head because, hey, if I had stepped on his head, he'd be dead. A bird come down and peck on his head. So what I just did is I uncovered his head, and that's not what he wanted. I don't know why he ain't go wrap up under something. But, hey, he trying to sunbathe to get maybe to get the uh, food to digest faster. Um, I'm going to think twice about going under this spot now, huh? That thing was big. He could have just jumped up and bit me in my face if I'd have been kneeling down right there, huh? Just snap. I'd have been like, bro, wait, we just said we wasn't going this way. Bro, we got to do it. Man, no, no, no. Ah, you just walked into a spider web. He right there, too. Man, this young be having me. Oh, why do I do this to myself? You need to stretch. I know. Let's get through it quick. My bad, y'all. I got to use y'all for protection. <laughs> yeet. My son say, Dad, you got to yeet or be yeeted. I don't know what it mean, but I ain't being yeeted. Ain't nobody yeeting on me. <laughs> I do the yeeting. <laughs> hey, good morning, y'all. Another beautiful day. We out here on our way. What we got over here? Uh, another shortcut we not deciding to take. Can't deal with nothing fake. Oh, yeah. So, like I said, oh, yesterday, we went for a bike ride with the kids. Took both of them out. Shot a video with the GoPro Max, because I think I'm about to start using the GoPro Max out in the yard. Hey, now that I didn't lost my GoPro 8, I don't know what to do. I went up to Wright Pat yesterday. I looked at the price of another GoPro 8, 7, and 9, and I'm going to be honest with you. I ain't ready to pay that. I don't feel like it's necessary, but I feel like it's necessary that I get back to shooting video. And so last night, what I did was, I got all that video uploaded. I did it in 4K, but because I'm like, hey, 4K is not working so well for me on upload speeds. Hey, last night I just went ahead and started uploading everything in 1080. Both videos, yesterday's video and today's video, well, the past two days video, I went ahead and uploaded both of them last night. So the 11th came up and I don't know, I deleted one in there, one's missing. I had a problem for a little bit and it all came from when I switched to 4K. I thought 4K was working smooth. It worked smooth one night. It worked smooth one night and then it didn't. And boy, it felt like I was coming up missing. I was only gone for like three days and I feel like I don't know. Like the world was about to forget about me. <laughs> ah, that's how the society go. It's like, hey, if you ain't moving in somebody's mind every day, boy. And actually, even with that, it don't work that well. But we got time, people. It look like it. But hey. What I tell you about that one every day. Don't treat it like tomorrow's guaranteed. Because it's not. But if you act like it ain't going to come. Hey, you're going to be in a world of hurt when it show up. Oh, my goodness. I ain't walking through that way. Whoa, whoa. Hey, live today to its fullest. And do your best to plan for tomorrow. 
because you will be reaping what you sowed today sometime tomorrow <laughs> hey what i'm saying is tomorrow to me is just the future hey how many people just be real with me how many people whatever age you are now that you watching this video and i just want you to imagine something if you watching this video i'm saying you're a special kind of person so let me just go ahead and get you to admit to this real quick who thought that they would be where they are and who they are today well just a piece of wood who thought that they would be where they are and who they are today i never thought that as a kid i'd be walking in the creek every morning i thought i was gonna be some fancy person or something i don't know but i'm out here walking in the creek every morning like by myself at that i never thought i'd be walking in no creek by myself like i never used to do that <laughs> well i guess i still ain't because i got all y'all with me now don't i yeah hey why don't y'all say what's up to each other Yep, if you got a YouTube channel, go ahead and drop a comment and say what channel you on. If you didn't made it this far, hey, because we're at the halfway point. You like me. <laughs> yep, you just like me. And you like me. So hit the like button. Can't you see? That's what I'm trying to tell you to do. And if you've been coming through, you might as well hit the subscribe button. I know you can type in morning walk every morning and I just pop up. I made it that easy for you. But let me make it easier for you. Hit the subscribe button. And then if you hit that post notifications, oh my goodness, you'll get to see what I see tomorrow if I see something tomorrow. And if I see something tomorrow, I'm going to say something tomorrow. I hope y'all be here tomorrow to hear what I have to say tomorrow if I'm here tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? But that's the whole plan. Hey, so yesterday, me and Miles got into a whole skit at the BX about guests. No, I'm saying, guess what we got into it about? Yep, that's what we got into it about. He saw a box of shoes and said, look, Dad, guess. I said, guess what? And it started from there. <laughs> oh, my goodness, me and him went on and on and on. And yeah, the whole time. Oh, whoa. That was true. We went on. Oh, I didn't say enough ons? We went on and on and on and on. The cipher kept rolling like a rolling stone. <laughs> oh yeah, hey, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. That means I'm about to tell y'all something that's true. You know that girl, Erica Badu? Yup, she used to be the love of my life. Y'all don't tell my wife, but it's true. Uh-huh. Hey, when she went through that, went for that walk in the city, down the block, yep. I tried to find that video. I was gonna save it back then. I didn't know what I was doing. Oh yeah, yep. I used to listen to everything she ever sang. <laughs> Where's she at these days? Uh huh. She probably hanging out with. Let me step on her next time I see. Oh, I'm just playing. Hey, but you see how you could think any of these would be a snake. Any of them would be a snake right here. That's what they all look like. And that's what he was trying to look like. See, right here, another one. Another one. Hey, so your boy, another one was on, was on, I don't know if it was TikTok or, I don't know. I barely be looking through these apps. Instagram, I think it was. So anyway, he was sitting there talking about a lot of you guys. Yep, there you go, still there. Oh, you done backed up some. Oh, he big, y'all. He big. That's just his head. And it's a nice size for a little guy. You backed up something, though. Oh, buddy, he waiting on something. You better not be waiting on me, buddy. You waiting on me. When I get back, it's going to be me and you. Hey, he was pretty big. I mean, not huge. But, and the fact that he's still just chilling there? Hey. That mean he ain't worried about me just like the deer ain't worried about me. That mean one of these snakes gonna get bold enough. Hey, you know what? What if he the same snake that a couple weeks ago I ran up out of the creek? What if he growing at that rate and he's some genetically mutated 
about to grow to full size in like a month like the ducks. You know what I'm saying? The ducks grow that fast. How come the snake ain't, right? That's what I'm saying. So he just out here planning my route out, trying to find out where I be. Next thing you know, he gonna be this big. Hey, y'all remember that one snake? You have to go back a few months now, y'all. Oh yeah, your boy been doing this for a while. Yeah, you have to go back a couple months when I jumped on that log and was like, it was a snake, an anaconda. Hey, he felt like I was talking about his mama, so he trying to size me up. Hey, we'll be out here again tomorrow, snake. See what happened. That snake from State Farm. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to you, buddy. Mm. <laughs> no creatures are harmed in the making of these videos. Hey, unless one jump bad, I'm gonna give him all I got and take all he had. Uh huh. Wear him on my feet and call that junk a fad. <laughs> I don't know nothing around with that except for somebody named Chad. <laughs> Uh-huh. I've been doing this since I was a wee lad. Wee little laddie. Oh, spider web. Man, I had my mouth open. <laughs> oh, you thought I was joking. <laughs> hey, yeah. Uh, look at that. Oh, yeah. We getting through. How many? How many? How many steps I got? I got 3,859 steps right now. I've been getting it, y'all. Every day, hitting my step goal. I don't think I missed. I'm gonna let y'all see one of these days. I for, I be forgetting, be having so much going on. No, I don't. I can get rid of these ducks anytime I want to, and I won't have nearly as much going on no more. But I want to bring them down here to the creek one time, yeah? Hey, sometimes they listen, sometimes they don't. I got one every morning that just wants to flap up out of the container, and I'm like, stop doing that. I do not want to grab you with feathers flapping everywhere. Man, I'm allergic. <laughs> got feathers floating around in the air. I feel like I'm breathing feathers. He be flapping in the morning. Stop flapping and let me pick you up. It's only one. Everybody else walk right up to me and be like, here, pick me up this way. He be the last one. Well, second to last one. And he get the flapping and I just be like, stop. Hey, I'm going to try and figure out which one he is. I'm going to be honest. I think they're walking in to be in the containers they want to be with the people or the ducks that they feel the most comfortable with. Cause they're starting to walk up to the, con to the containers the way that they want to be put in. It's starting to be very interesting. I'm saying these ducks are not dumb. They're not, they're actually very smart. I think I showed y'all that this morning with, they wait until I get done fixing up the inside of their pen and then they walk right in. I don't have to do nothing to them. Yeah, I'm saying the only hard thing is them getting used to the new area that is frustrating that is very frustrating i guess the next time i move them which it'll be into their permanent home the next time or they will be moving permanently away from my house one of the two but i'm planning on building them a permanent home the lady who had the house of raccoons uh i'm gonna go ahead and build one of those kind of cages because you can add to it and make it as big as you want and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna lay a mesh flooring down on the, on the bottom put some dirt on top of it and then I'm gonna build the uh, uh, the enclosure and once I do that it'll keep the fox and stuff like that from being able to dig under and get inside of it and that'll make it so it'll be safe and then I'll keep putting them in it and once I can do that then I'll show you how hard it is to get these ducks to move to where you want them to go but then they'll be perfect oh well no I won't be able to do that because they'll be permanently outdoors then hey uh we had a good walk this morning. I feel good that I got a few videos back up last night. I feel bad that that uh it took so long to get this junk back rolling, I feel like. But I don't even know what fixed it other than me just dropping the file size down. Uh, shoot, I dropped it down by half. Going from 4K back to 1080, it went down by half. It actually went down by more than half. 
but I got two videos up. I'll just stay in 1080 until I figure it out, get my internet speeds up. But anyway, I want to thank y'all for tuning in yet again. This is your boy. Better yet, call me your friend and your brother, your kin. We can do this again. Hey, if everything go according to plan. Hey, let me know what y'all doing. What's going good in y'all life? Hey, let's work together. Help each other out. Like I said, subscribe to each other. Help each other out. This is how we get to where we're going. If you ain't subscribed to my channel, please. If you've been here, help me out. Hit the like button. I ain't asking you to watch every day. I ain't even asking you to watch all the way. You chose to. What can I say? Hey, this your boy and I'm out. Y'all have a good day.